This is pigeon. pigeon. One full sentence. Now, what's in your own? No. What's in the worry? Why you must see Eddie love you? Like, imagine like we're in an office. How you day? I day. I day can't be. How your weekend? My weekend day. Um, nothing they happen. I know well. Hungry they cash me. I want to. You don't finish your assignment where they gave yesterday. Where is why you going with the boy? <laughs> I don't know the. <laughs> Yes, okay, yeah, okay. Okay. Sounds funny, you guys? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, as you can see, I have Oye again. I'm sorry guys, she hasn't opened her channel yet, so <laughs> we have to manage her on here. Oye, please be gingered. No, one day bye. She's actually not feeling fine now, so yeah, get well soon, babe. But I just begged her to, you know, come and let's just answer a few questions. What are your Nigerian names? Mm -hmm. That's all. Uh, only one name. Yeah, my middle name is French. Okay. Sherry. That's true. That's I used to speak French in case it's small. But I don't understand where that has gone now. <laughs> my own Igbo names are Ijoma, Chineyenwa, Okafo. Chineyenwa. <laughs> now, my dad has the name he calls me, but that's none of your business. So, but is it Igbo? Igbo? Yeah, it's an Igbo name. Was it? That's none of your business. <laughs> <laughs> Is it Amaka? Amaka? No, at all. Okay. Okay. That's actually a nice name. Amaka. But, like, that's not Namaka, no, no, like the no, whole thing. Yeah. Oh. And then, um, yeah, so that's, those are my Igbo names. And what does Onye mean? Gift. God's gifts. Onye Chuku. Yeah, God's gifts. And then Ijama means. Some people say safe journey, but I call it successful venture. And then China Yenwa is God that gives child. And then look have children born on one of the four. Yeah, like OKK okay, okay, too. Yeah, exactly. That's true. You didn't even say your surname. Yeah, OKK. Okay, yeah, OKK okay. okay, okay is also a market day name. Yeah. yeah there's Okafo, OKK, Okori, Okonkwa. Okonkwa. Then I'm an Ipo girl. Okonkwa, AK, Afo, and Ori. Those are the four market days. So yeah, that's another thing you guys know about our culture. Were you born in Nigeria? No. So where were you born? I was born in Libreville, Gabon. <laughs> I was born in Nigeria in the Delta State. But what's your favorite Nigerian movie? Nigerian movie. I think in recent times, 50. Okay, I haven't seen that one. I like that one. I prefer it to the one everybody likes. Wedding party. Yeah. Okay, I haven't seen 50. I think the wedding party is amazing. There's just one Nigerian movie that always like I just remember the president's daughter. I don't think people really know remember that movie, but I think it was Victoria Iyama that did the movie and I used to watch that movie over and over again. Like was Ram in it? I can't even remember who oh. else was it. I just thought she was a really sports kid that the children's president's daughter. The title of the movie was the president's daughter. Right. And it was Victoria Iyama. Because I used to watch it a lot. Oh, what did Regina ask? I know it was Chayama. and yeah i really love that movie but obviously there's like so many other yeah nice. i prefer like the, old the old ones the old the old yeah, exactly yeah. 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 and fugitive fugitive was very yeah, good I, I can't remember i can't remember ah that one was very i can't remember even living in bondage i just know andy <laughs> but i can't even remember the plot that movie was oh, very good yeah, exactly merit, <laughs> like <a> merit, <laughs> merit <of Chico. laughs> And then there's some like really funny ones like Osofia in London. Oh yeah, I love Miss Saibu. Like Miss Saibu, anything you see Miss Saibu in is amazing and funny. What's your favorite Nigerian TV series? Hey, I don't know. Um, Papa Jasko. Fuji House of Komosho. Fuji House of Komosho. Yes, I used to remember that they had Fuji House every Sunday. Yes, yes, they were playing that. Fuji House of Komosho. Eh, Kiriko in Jama, that guy in Jama, John in Jama. I think he was in the, he was in Fuji yeah, House. Yeah, 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 yeah. I really yes, like yes, him yes, from yes, Fuji yes, House yes, of Komosho. Yes, yes, yes. My own cousin Mosu, wife from Batu. Hey, what's your favorite Nigerian music right now? Um, what's this one? Um. I think, um, do you know, let me not lie, I, I, I like really? old Nigerian yeah, just, just, songs, yeah. you know this song, um, we gotta say I'm a girl teaser, be a good squeezer, teaser, I'm looking for a diva, for shiza, what you need is a geezer, cool like a freezer, rule like a teaser, I'm a girl teaser, I'm a girl teaser, yeah, that was that song, yeah. and then he featured someone, I can't remember, but yeah, I really like that song, See what Whiskey is doing, and but I love for that David was full, I know it's that annoying, okay, no, 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 Samba, Banky W is actually an old song. Let me play it for you. Mm. Samba. Oh my god. I don't know why I, I just really love new it was, songs. It's actually old. I watched that your video with songs like 2017. Songs we are loving in 2017. Okay, okay. No, that Samba wasn't even there. Like oh, I think okay. I just recently we fell in love with the song. Jassy, sorry. Yeah, I think this is the song I'm loving right now. Like it's not even now, but I really love it. Oh my god. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what's your favorite Nigerian food? White. <laughs> it's boring. Yeah, it doesn't matter. White rice is stew a chicken <laughs> or fried plantain. <laughs> Yeah, mm. stew is like tomato sauce. That's what it is in yeah. Nigerian um, meals. So mine is um, swallow, obviously. Pounded yam and I think okra soup. <laughs> yeah, pounded yam and okra soup. Are you serious? Yeah. I even like okra soup. <laughs> I really love okra soup. I think soup. my favorite soup is uh -huh. okazi. Oh, okay. Ofe okazi. Are you, you're not okay. No. Okay. Anywho, so what's your favorite Nigerian snack? Puff puff. Yeah, mine is kilishi. After plantain chips just follows in like this, but yeah, <laughs> the highest. When last did you go to Nigeria? And how many times have you been to Nigeria? I think two years ago. I went last year, but just for like a few days in January, since, and hopefully I'll go next year. I'm born in Nigeria, I've been in Nigeria for like such a long time, so I go to Nigeria at least once a year since I've been here. What's your tribe? I'm and what state are you from? I'm from Anambra. No, let me say it all. I'm from Newichi. Newi in Anambra state. What the local government area? Newi. Um, Okuno Newichi. Bam. Hey! <laughs> I'm from Anambra state. You don't really know local government area. Mm -hmm. Ubosi village. Umwata. Okay. Yeah, so I'm Igbo. And say something in your language. Newi in the bay. Kekunume. I have a little bit of a I have a little bit of a I know about this video. I'm a channel. I have a little bit of a video. Ibo is not complete at all. Like, what's camera in <laughs> Well, well, fair enough. Camera Kodo, wasn't invented there. Yeah, when the windows. Even yeah. things like table. What table in Ibo? Tebulu. Uh, tebulu. Tebulu. Like about, what do you like most about Nigeria? The people. Like Nigerians are just happy. Yeah. Even with all the suffering. They keep going. Vibe, especially in Lagos. Like everything is just upbeat from yeah, when you upbeat. wake up yeah, and yeah, then you yeah. hear like I get a bread seller yeah. on the road. I guess the spirit. Like, yeah. Yes, the yeah. spirit. The yeah. spirit of the people. I don't know, it's just home, Sha, to be honest. I don't know if like I appreciate Nigeria more because I'm not I don't live in Nigeria right now. Like anytime mm. I know I'm so excited, so happy. Maybe it's because I'm coming back, I don't know. But it's just home for me to be honest. Most of my friends are in Nigeria. In fact, I think people are also very helpful here there. Unlike here where you like you can starve and just be homeless for a long time and no one yeah. notices. But in Nigeria there's always I don't know, I guess it's because it's home. Okay. Yeah, and also the culture is communal. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, right. exactly. So exactly. you never feel as yeah. alone. Your grandma will come stay in your yeah. house and like here yeah. where like People don't even want to see you their I don't know, grandmothers right living with them and stuff like that. But Nigeria is a very Yeah, yeah so it just like, your amazes neighbor can me, like yeah. When yeah. people like have been dead here for two mm. weeks and nobody like, nobody knows. knows. Like it can't even people. happen because in Nigeria your neighbor you will come and come and come and look for you. You've not come to buy to go. Yeah. So what do you hate about Nigeria? Corruption. Corruption is everywhere, Sha, isn't yeah. it? Like, the, thing, so, the thing about Nigeria's corruption, I think there's, there's upsides to it because at least there's ways to some things. Unlike here where you can't do this, you cannot do it. But in yeah. Nigeria, like, there could be ways to get it done. <laughs> the annoying part of that corruption That's is what's holding us like, back. Getting jobs. Yeah. Like you and someone who apply it just because you don't know someone. Like nothing is fair. Over here, you know your efforts, things will show, your hard work will show when it comes to like some kind of things, you know. But in Nigeria, it's quite frustrating. I guess I just said description everywhere. So whatever. Do you have any Nigerian nicknames? Oni peperepe. Oni peps. Oni peps. Or Pepsi. Or peps. Pep. How is Pepsi Nigerian? Peperepe. Peperepe. That's a Nigerian nickname. My uncle is called me Pepe. Yeah, Miss Pepe. Oh. Eh, from one of my just Yes, my just but I would obviously Oibo Pepe. Like, what's your light skin in night? They call you Oibo, and then the sunny of it is Pepe. They call you Oibo Pepe. Yeah. <laughs> it's for the sunny of it. <laughs> what makes you different amongst other Nigerians? What do you think that, like, it's a general thing with Nigerians, but, like, you're different? Nothing. Nothing. I am the typical <laughs> Nigerian baby. Typical Nigerian girl, loud and yeah. very. I don't know. I yeah, even style really wise, I know I can be edgy, but you can see you see right. so many Nigerians that are edgy. But yeah. yeah, I guess just that. There's nothing else I'll say that makes me different from other Nigerians. But why are Igbo people like that though? Why are we ashamed of our? I don't. Know, is it that we're ashamed, or we just don't carry it in our head that we don't just don't see it as important? That we know it's important, but we don't make that effort. 
Because I don't think our parents were ashamed of the language. I don't think right. so. Yeah. But, but we just don't were they take it proud so of it. Because if they were not proud, I think they would have spoken it to us. My parents were like, speaking it to us, but they were not demanding we responded right. in it. Right. Right. So I get they what were you even mean. to themselves, they were speaking it to themselves. Yeah. So I don't think they were not proud of it. They were just not taking it as serious as other people take the fact that their kids should speak the language. language yeah. I think the war has something to do with why Igbo people don't really speak the like language. the Biafran war. Mm. Because honestly, think about it, it's, it's a bit disturbing that if you in if we continue like this in the next ten years, yeah. people won't speak Igbo, Igbo anymore. Igbo. God forbid though. So God forbid though. Yeah. Igbo people, let's speak our language more. Okay. Hi, Bido, from Hi, Kita. Let's do the rest of this in video in Igbo. In Asupijin. One full sentence. Now, what do you want to know? What do they worry you? Why must he end in abuse? You see, because... What do they worry you? Okay, why must he end in abuse? Do you see? Do you know? But, 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 but why is that? What do they create? The first thing that will let like is abuse. <laughs> viciousness. Right? But, uh, why, you why can't we just converse? Like civilized, imagine like we're in an office. How, office. how you day? How you day? day? I day can't be. How your weekend? My weekend day, nothing they happen. I know well. Hungry they cash me. I want you. You finished your assignment where they gave yesterday. Where? Why are you going with the boy? <laughs> I don't know the. <laughs> Yes, yes, I can speak yeah, with you. Okay. 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 I was wondering where you guys. I can't even speak with around your house. Represents your culture. We're in Oni's house, so over to your sister. I have paintings. I have artworks. Mm. I have. <laughs> yeah, and this yeah, this thing carries. Cute. Yeah, like very African. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, this is my own. What's your own? What's the most ridiculous question you've ever been asked about your country or tribe? Why are Igbo people so raz? Why are they not educated? Why are they uncivilized? And why do they just sell car parts? People tend to think Igbo people like money too much. And yeah, I think it is true as well. So, but any the ridiculous, most ridiculous question? I think someone has asked if we have Wi-Fi in Nigeria. <laughs> Internet, yeah, right, yeah. But the person obviously was in Nigeria. But I was like, yeah. The person's face even be as well. And this person even called in Nigeria, so people would just say, <laughs> Africa, like they don't even know where, it's, where, where <laughs> Congo. They think it's Congo, Nigeria, and Africa. There's something one girl tell me that she thought it was just three countries or something like that. So are uh, they inside? You know, just asking. Yeah, I love all the intelligent people out there. You know. <laughs> anyway, so that's it, guys. Do you have any other thing to contribute to this? Aside that Igbo people should teach their kids the language. Kova, please can you just cut this part? Yeah, well, yeah, Man, I'm, I'm rolling temperature <laughs> now. My body is all hot. <laughs> the next generation of Nigerians, we should arise Quits. and end corruption. corruption. Let's yeah. move our country forward. Nebani, Kwenu. Hey! Kwenu. Hey! Kwezuonu. Hey! Pa!